What is up everybody? Welcome back to another History in Graveyards. Today I am at Old Tenant Church and Cemetery. Um, there's a little story that happened here during the Battle of Monmouth, which was which took place right down the, the road actually. <coughs> um, technically this is kind of still on the battlefield too, but there's a little story attached to a ghost story, and let's get into that. Okay, so the story goes, there was a soldier that was taking a break and he was sitting on a headstone i guess just chilling out it was a very hot day that day and um a stray cannonball came flying through the air and took his leg off now the his, i guess his fellow soldiers around him or people that or the soldiers that saw this happen uh picked him up and put him in the church the second pew from the rear i believe where there is still blood stains to this day i don't think i can get in there today but um, if you do come here, check it out, and you will see blood stains on the second pew. If you're at the altar, looking all the way straight down the middle to the left, second pew, you'll see it. It's a weird name, pew. All right, guys, so before I bring you to the actual headstone, uh, which was cut in half from the cannonball as well as taking his leg off, um, <clears throat> I just wanted to run through this graveyard really fast and show you some of these really cool headstones, very old headstones. Now this, uh, this graveyard predates the Revolutionary War, so there's a lot of very, very old graves here and headstones. Mary, your headstone fell, Jesus. All right, guys, so I found the actual headstone that he was taking a rest or break on when that stray cannonball came through the air and took off his leg as well as the top half of the headstone. And here you guys go. This is the exact headstone he was sitting at. If he was only sitting on this one or one of these two, he probably would have uh, survived. So after they brought him into the church, he, uh, they laid him out on the second to last pew or seat from the rear. And uh, I believe that's where he died, is actually in the church. Not sure about that, but I believe he did die there. All right, so if it was that soldier Enoch, uh, he's buried somewhere in this graveyard. I'm not exactly sure where. Uh, but historians now believe that this is the man that uh, was struck by the cannonball and died and lost his leg and died. And here you go, in memory of Captain Henry Fauntleroy. So historians do now believe that Captain Henry Fauntleroy was the man killed by that stray cannonball while he was taking a rest on one of the headstones here at Old Tenant Cemetery. All right, gang, so whether you believe it was the guy Enoch, who they originally thought it was, or Captain Henry Fauntleroy, or Fantler, Fauntleroy, I can, oh, we can never fucking say names right, or him, uh, that's up to you. But either way, a soldier was taking a rest <laughs> on that headstone right there. And uh, did lose his leg and did die in this church. So if you do want to find this headstone that all this lore and story is about, it's kind of towards the front. So I'll give you a little guideline here. From that side door there from the church, it is row. That's row one. Well, this is like a monument thing. So you have row one. Row two. This is kind of off of row two. Row three. Row four. Right next to the tree. And his headstone is one, two, three, four, five, six, seventh in. Right there. Also, uh, his ghost is known to roam the grounds at night. 
Apparently, if you come in here at night, which you are not allowed to, it is closed and there are gates. And if you are caught out here, you will be in trouble big time. But uh, supposedly at night, his apparition walks these grounds. Maybe he's still stuck in time, still uh, thinks he's on his break. I don't know. Doesn't know what happened to him. Who knows? I guess when something that quick happens to you or, uh, you know, that, that little jolt of adrenaline and uh, energy when you die just kind of gets locked in time and in your mind and it just keeps replaying maybe that's what ghosts and apparitions are who knows all right gang so if you ever do decide to come here to freehold new jersey at the old tenant cemetery slash church and check this headstone out i hope that helps you a little bit moving on to the next video guys take care